in Greenville, North Carolina. This campus is very unique in that we can serve almost any client looking for oral solid dose, looking for sterile manufacturing, development, or commercialization. We have over 100,000 square feet of space in our facilities that can be modified. We also have a very strong TT group that can take products outside of the network and bring that into Greenville, North Carolina for commercial production. So when potential clients come to the site, we always start at the beginning of the process. So we will walk them through dispensing, and we go into granulation, compression and encapsulation, and then we go into the packaging area for them to be able to see the whole flow of the product throughout the site. Within our granulation area, we have uh, several capabilities, which include dry granulation, wet granulation, water coating, and top spray. In addition to standard compression, we also do bilayer and compression coating. For our encapsulation area, we also do multi-bead filling. One of our primary strengths is to be able to work with controlled substances, as well as with product with a toxicity level up to 3B. Within the OSD site, we have a wide variety of capabilities, but we're also willing to modify our current capabilities as well as add any additional capabilities based on customer need. Continued manufacturing is important because it allows us to do new things that we weren't able to do before with patch manufacturing. There's no scale-up issues with it, so we don't have to worry about changing from small-scale development to large-scale production. That allows us to go a lot faster, have a lot more control, and much higher quality than we were able to before. So our continuous production begins with the dispensing of the material. This happens in a special room where the material is taken out of the drums and put into uh, special conveyors that allow it to be transported to the next step of the process. The process after that is feeding. This involves several different machines which take the powder and meter it very carefully into our uh, continuous process. This is a very important part of our process because the rate at which it's metered uh, determines the drug concentration in the final process. From the blender, the powder flows into our encapsulator. The encapsulator takes capsule shells, opens them, places a powder slug inside each of them, and then closes the capsule shell. So we consider Greenville the center of excellence from a packaging perspective, and it's because of the diversity and the flexibility that we have built within. The packaging area has multiple capabilities. Uh, within the bottle operation, we actually are able to package multiple sizes, starting from a very small 30cc bottle up to a very large round bottle 400cc. From a blistering perspective, we also have technology in regards to cold forming and thermoforming, so some of the products may require some additional moisture barriers. So we currently have five lines. We have a lot of flexibility within the lines. We have lines that can run up to 20, 40 different SKUs and products, but we also, if we have to, we can always dedicate a line depending on the volume and the client requirements. So our room has the capability of having control for temperature and humidity. Our rooms are also designed to uh, support highly potent uh, compounds. And uh, the way that they're actually designed, again, they have individual HVAC units, uh, they have dust collectors to make sure that we ensure that there's no dispersion of the material across the room. We work closely with the regulatory agencies uh, to ensure that we're ahead of market trends and making sure that we meet our customer needs in the future for any regulations that will change. An example of that may be serialization. And we're also ahead on ag aggregation, which is a future requirement that we actually jumpstart knowing that the clients will need that in the coming years. Serialization is very important to our clients because it'll help us track um, how the product is manufactured all the way to the point of use to the customer. The Greenville side has two lines that are serialization ready. The aggregation process is a very interesting process in regards to the complexity of it, but also the simplicity of it as well. The process starts with uh, each bottle getting a code that actually gets read by the system. Uh, we apply a helper code to basically marry that particular bottle to a number, and then we start aggregating all of the codes into a bundle. So now you can actually say that bottles 1 through 12 went to bundle number 1. And the aggregation process continues into the case level, the pallet level. So whenever we actually send a product outside of the site, you can actually tell where bottle one is across the entire batch. So what clients can expect from our site is that we go beyond just the metrics. We're a partnership and it is as important for us to get the medicine in our patient's hands as it is our clients. And so when working with Greenville site, you're working with a true partner. 
What I love about working here at this facility is I work with top-notch professionals with the common purpose that we're serving our patients with medicine that they desperately need. And that is a very fulfilling purpose and mission. Deliver with capacity and compassion from Greenville, North Carolina.